Hey you guys, DJ L here, uh, back again with a, another product review. Like I said, this is a product review. <laughs> and uh, I have the HP PhotoSmart, I believe it's A something, um, I'm not sure, but we'll open it up and see. Um, I, did I did get this, I think, two months ago, and it comes with a case, as you guys can see here. So, actually the printer is inside, and uh, we'll open this up here. So, I'll throw the case to the side. And uh, here's the printer itself. What it is basically, let me actually put this down here like that, okay. Um, so what it is essentially is, it's a PhotoSmart printer that has uh, touch screen capabilities. And actually you can pull open the screen there. So actually, let me bring this back to show you the entirety of it. Um, but you can pull it back and pull it up like that and then it has two tabs on the sides these tabs right here where you can fold the screen back and it goes like that and then when you pull the actual, oops, when you pull this out the screen actually pops up and it reveals all of your stuff so you do have your USB your SD card or that's MS Duo and uh, your well mo it's actually memory stick duo whatever you guys get it um, your SD or XD and here is where you have your ink and it takes standard ink which is pretty cool and here is your stylus very fancy stylus yes I know <laughs> and as I fold this down here's where the actual uh, printer paper comes out when you print and it has a cool design on it, it's pretty cool as we get to the front, you have, it says touch smart here, and then you have your power button and your screen, and then it has a, like a bar for you to carry. Moving on to the sides, nothing really too exciting on the sides, but on the back, you have your paper, where you insert your paper here, and that's where it comes out the front. So actually, let me grab the cord, and we will turn this on. Oh, and by the way, here is your standard printer cable and your uh, power DC in. So just turn this around, and we'll turn it on. So grab the cord here. So here's the cord. Um, it's This thing is fairly big, but whatever, you know. So I have a plug conveniently right next to me and we will plug this in the back like so and on we'll flip the screen up and should be loading up soon We take the stylus out, and you hear it. So let me go a little bit closer for you guys who can't really see too well. So we'll just do a full shot of the screen. So we get a little bit lower. So it says view and print. It says create slideshow or Bluetooth. So actually, let me go to Bluetooth. It says searching Bluetooth device and that will pick up my phone so it won't pick up my phone now because that's what I'm using um, just because I haven't been using my regular camera but actually let me grab my camera uh, SD card and pop it up alright guys so here's my SD card so let me pull this back as I open this I insert my SD card And there you see the light go off. So, now it says uh, 23 photos and 18 videos. Actually, let me close this up just a little bit. So you guys can see the screen here. Don't want to obscure your view. Your view. And it does show you actually um, your the last photo that you picked. As, as like a pile, almost like the new iPad. So if you hit view and print, 
going to show you your um, photos that you have taken recently. So if you click on it, as I click on this one, so there you go. There's one. I can go back to here, these arrows here. And I can click back. It's actually fake blood that I made for a movie. So I click this way. Sorry if you guys can't see too well. I'm trying to do the best I can here with um, what I've got. See if I can turn my light down. That makes any difference. And it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't. But actually, let me put it. Let me stand it up. So it's actually facing up a little bit. If you guys don't mind. Okay. So this is a little better. So as you guys can see. You can go to print, and you can hit print, and it will print. I'll hit print just for the sake of it, but I don't have any paper, so it's alright. So it says low paper, blah, blah, blah. I'll hit X because I don't have any paper. So if you hit home, you can go to uh, create, and it will say albums. So you can create an album. You got seasons, kids. Special events in daily life. We'll do um, daily life, I guess. You can go to general and hit no. And it shows you all of your pictures there in a row. And then you have your slideshow. So it says select photos. And I'll select this one, that one, and this one. And I will go over to select this one and that one. And done. And it says resume. So let's see if this actually does a slideshow. So there you go. Transitioning pretty well. the screen here go home and you got your tools here you got your print test page print sample page printer status align cartridge and clean cartridge let's see we'll go back to home here go to the settings you go to preferences you got your sound your print preview your photo fix your red eye removal your date and time your paper type there you go and you got, let's see, Bluetooth, Bluetooth radio, passkey, device name, device address, reset Bluetooth and security level, as well as visibility. Go back here. Then you have your help and whatever. And this just tells you about it. And you see you have your Bluetooth icons here, as well as your ink. And that's pretty much it, you guys. Pretty pretty cool um, printer there. Again, it does print 5x7 and 4x6. And as I take my SD card out, and we will flip this down and off. And there you go, guys. That was the HP PhotoSmart printer uh, for $199. Pretty cool price, excellent price, and uh, so there you go, just check it out, and I'll see you guys later.